Hi, my name is Upesh Bosle and I work for Motion Validation System Dynamics team. With the conventional MNF approach based on the linear mode shapes for incorporating flexibility in MBD model in atoms, some of the dynamic used to get missed, especially when a particular part goes in non-linear mode of deformation. User used to study the non-linear behavior in FE tool post exporting the loads from atoms. The inconvenience has been addressed with the addition of Adams Max Flex feature. Adams Max Flex will capture geometric nonlinearity, material nonlinearity, and boundary condition nonlinearity by creating high fidelity model to achieve high accuracy result. The actual workflow for creating a nonlinear flexible part in Adams is very simple. The primary prerequisite input for this is Nastran Sol 400 deck in the form of BDF file. Importing the BDF with the relevant inputs gets you the flexible part. Upon creating a flexible part, it can be constrained to the other rigid flex part using the interface point. The fully constrained model can be simulated. The result sets uh, uh, includes will include a stress strain or deformation data. One of the quite common testing in aerospace industry is aeroplane wing bending. The left image shows the physical test trick required for testing the bending behavior of an aeroplane wing. The wing can go into a nonlinear deformation. The similar virtual test environment can be modeled in atoms with the wing model as a nonlinear flexible body with the constraint matching to the ones used in the actual test, test trick. We can, see, we can see simulating virtually can be potential saving in terms of cost and development time. Here you can see some of the other industry use case models. Uh, where uh, the vehicle suspension LCA goes into the buckling mode. Uh, you can also simulate uh, the bushings where you can use the self-contact support provided for the max flex and the wind turbine industry.